Hey everyone, it's Billy Hale. Today I wanted to talk about the Trapper and some holster uh, gun belt things that I wanted. Now these are the Bandit, Bandolier, Bandit gun belt, Bandit holster, and Bandit offhand holster. We're going to go in the menu here and check this out. I didn't understand how this worked, but I did my research and figured out that to get the gun belts I wanted, I was like, I'm going to pick my favorite gun belts out of all the options here. What do I have to do to get them? And so... Uh, there are certain things you have to do to open up all the bandit leather. So here we are. There's, I'm going to go back for a second just to discuss with you. So what we have here are the uh, horseman, sharpshooter, weapons expert, bandit, gambler, master hunter, explorer, herbalist. And so let's say that the herbalist, by the way, is pretty awesome. Um, it's very Native American leather work, and I would love that. But you're going to have to go into the challenges that you can go into the menu and find. And you're going to have to start burning through those challenges. So I went through all of these and I thought, what is the coolest leather that I could first try to earn? And the bandit it most closely resembles what I would want to wear in real life. We'll take a look at that in a minute. Uh, in fact, we'll take a look at that right now. So we go into the bandit. So here's the bandolier. Now, essentially, this is a ammo belt. Um, if I were making one myself, I would probably get that leather wet and make it so it would hang on the shoulder right. But what you see here is we have border tooling and, and probably some more border tooling right here. And then we have these spots. We have conchos, um, just a really nice piece. And it's black, and I like it. But that is not all. Um, let me tell you what these upgraded things will do. Where am I looking? The reinforced bandoliers increase ammo capacity for repeaters, rifles, and shotguns. So not only is it much cooler looking, it actually upgrades your ability to uh, what you can carry around on your person. You might say, okay, Billy, you have access to this bandolier, but how did you do that? So to get the bandit bandolier... You have to complete challenge one, hold up five townsfolk, which is super simple. Um, most, if you pick the ones who don't look like cowboys or wearing pistols, they tend to just give you what you need. So that is how I gained access to that. And then when you do that, in fact, I'm looking at the IGN site over here. I'm just going to drag it over so you can look at it too. So you see what I see. Um, when you get challenge one, that opens up challenge two and challenge three and challenge four. But that is not how the bandit gun belt set works. So for me to get the gun belt itself, which would be the thing I would want after the bandolier, which I already have, I have to get to challenge 10. And I believe I'm at challenge five right now, so I'm not even close. And I have to complete, check this out, five train robberies without dying or being caught. That it doesn't even seem possible. So that should be exciting. The bandit holster, which I do have and did get is challenge three, rob the cash register in any four shops in one day. I went to St. Denise and um, I would rob and run or rob and get shot, which works probably better than robbing and fighting because fighting takes a long time. Getting shot and coming back, although you do lose money if you, if you uh, take the uh, get shot route. But it didn't take that long to do. It was super simple. And then Bandit Offhand Holster, which I really need because I have an offhand holster that's not upgraded. I don't see an option to do that in the catalog. Complete Challenge 7. Rob $50 worth of cash and valuables from Townsfolk or Traveler. That seems like it would be super simple to do. And then once you do that, you can come back to the Trapper and buy everything that you want. And then I might go to the next thing I might want. So I'm hitting play again. The gun belt looks awesome. This is the stock or the upgraded, and then that's the bandit. This looks great. Man, I, would, I could make this. I have a holster somewhere with spots on it, but nothing black like this. There's a lot of uh, rivets around that leather there, but it looks pretty good. And so you can't see it. This is a, not something that they need to fix. You can't see the holster you just bought. You can't rotate around. I'm sure that will be an update. And then I thought, well, let's go and see what I'm missing. Am I missing something in Weapons Expert? And to me, the Weapons Expert doesn't look that great. So I go to Horseman. Horseman looks just like Bandit, except it's brown. And I'm obviously ripping through these menus. Back to the Bandit. I'm just looking. I'm like, what is the difference here? So the Gambler. 
Oh, the Master Hunter man looks like Crocodile Dundee and not for me. And I'm going really fast, but I think that's how you guys like it. So then uh, I went back in and I was like, what else can I get? Because I've been killing things and I'm like, hats, 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 cha -cha. But then I realized, of course, as we all know, but I always forget, that everything must be a perfect pelt. So to come back and get any of this stuff, I'm going to have to actually hunt and purposefully get, uh, and I was in here seeing if I had anything, because I sometimes lose stuff off the back of my horse. It gets knocked off. I've had a perfect alligator and perfect grizzly. But uh, you go back out, you hunt, figure out maybe the one thing that you want, go hunt it down and come back and get it. And that's what I'm doing with the bandit. That concludes my uh, piece. The music you're hearing is me. You can go check it out on links in the, in the description below. Hit subscribe. No, it's actually... I don't know. Anyway, Billy Hale. I'm um, also doing a video on some rare horses and where to find them. And I'll put that in the tab up here. All right, y'all. Sum it down.